Hey everybody, it's Jason from the Texas Gun Vault, and today I want to come to you with a video about my thoughts and opinions on a trend I have noticed in the firearms world the past few years, and actually see what you guys think as well. I have two guns on the table today that are very similar. I have a CZ-75B Omega Tactical and a CZ-75SPO-1 tactical. These guns are pretty much identical in size and in function, with the exception of one thing. And that's going to be the dust cover. Yeah, I mean, how many YouTube channels are out there talking about the dust cover of pistols? Well, not many. And this is something that I have noticed as a trend, even in the world of 1911s, where you have standard 1911s and many of the new 2011 style pistols that omit the shorter dust cover with the scallops. Now, I guess this is going to be more of an aesthetic choice for me, but I know for some other people, this is going to be a practical or tactical choice. But here I'll start with my CZ-75B Omega and this is going to have pretty much the same profile as the original CZ-75s and many of the older pistols kind of have this design and I think it does go back to the 1911 but also an era before we had accessories and we needed rails to put them on. I've always found these types of guns to be much more aesthetically pleasing and what I'm talking about here is we have the frame that goes out to about here and we have the slide which of course encompasses the longer barrel and so we have some of the slide that sticks out the front of the frame and many times gun companies will taper this down you can even see here on the top of the slide we have a thicker frame and then as we get to the front of the slide it tapers down I just find that to be very aesthetically pleasing a gun that has more curves I think for me just has the right look and maybe that's just me talking from somebody that loves the look of the old classic Colts, the 1911s and such. But that trend that I'm talking about in modern firearms design is to eliminate that shorter dust cover and go with a dust cover that goes all the way to the end of the slide and many times you'll see this on older design firearms so we can add an accessory rail it also adds a little bit of weight and rigidity to the frame depending on the model of course these both are metal so it doesn't really matter but we have this bigger beefier front end as you can see the front of that slide is not tapered in any way. For me, from an aesthetic standpoint, this is very blocky and very boring. It's much more industrial. For me, it doesn't have that look. It doesn't have that style that I like. But I know from a practical standpoint, this is gonna be about the only way that we can put on an accessory rail. So if you want a light or a laser or something else that you can put out here, you just can't do it here on the CZ75B Omega. There's no place for it. But if you like the practicality of accessories like that, we have this elongated and bigger dust cover. So I just wanted to tell you that when it comes to looks, and I think guns are works of art, I prefer firearms that don't have that longer dust cover, things that have that scallop here in the front. I just find that to be much more beautiful and aesthetically pleasing. I think that is just a great look. I love seeing that on 1911s. And many gun companies, I think, are designing them this way, not just because of the dust cover. I actually think this is easier to machine. You have many more flat surfaces where obviously it takes a CNC machine a lot longer to cut out the these little scallops. So I kind of find that a lot of gun companies are going to this and I think they're going to be a little bit on the lazy side. I know, I know some people are going to say I got this completely wrong because it's way better to have that rail. I just find this to not be as beautiful, not as sleek, not as sexy. It's just blocky and boring. But I want to ask you guys, what do you guys think? Which one do you prefer and why? I'm telling you now, I like the old style and the original. You can take off that accessory rail if I have that really cool scallop look in the front. But if you want to be a tactical operator, you might like this one. So tell me in the comment section below, which one do you like and why? You know what I think. So as always, thanks for watching.